Hello everyone and welcome to the Crypto Session Brief. We're on Wednesday the 10th of August 2022. A bit of risk off uh, seen across global markets so far today and uh, basically following it through from yesterday as well. We did see some moves down inside yesterday's uh, trading session for cryptos uh, and uh, they've just tried stabilizing a little bit today so far. I must say a bit of a fade actually on Bitcoin for example which is now trading flat on the day. Uh, we're about an hour, no, less than an hour, an hour, around half an hour away from the US CPI. That's the largest uh, economic calendar event of the week. And uh, could, of course, be market moving. The CPI over the past uh, six months at a minimum has been... Uh, uh, has been probably one of the more volatile events that we've been uh, that we've been uh, experiencing every single month because of course it really plays into the hands of what um, uh, what the Fed or what the Fed will do and of course that leads into then to risk assets. Do they uh, lessen liquidity in markets by raising rates by um, uh, intensifying their QT program, redu reducing liquidity, uh, or did they go the opposite way? So that's been the main uh, sort of question marks throughout the year so far. Um, and um, where we at for then on, on cryptos, basically if you see a higher print than expected, we're going to see some selling, I would say, in risk. So you're probably going to see moves down maybe into 0.3345 on Ripple. Uh, Bitcoin, you'll probably see a move down into that 50-day moving average and also the bottom of the trend, uh, the, the, the up channel. I was saying um, in recent briefs that the bottom of this channel is a pretty good buying area, but if we do get a hot inflation print today, uh, maybe it will be a case of you know seeing if this holds. If it doesn't, then it's a breakout and a move down to test the recent swing low there around twenty one thousand, just below twenty one thousand, could be on the cards. But if we get a lower number than expected, or something comes in as uh, you know right on the dot, then uh, this could be basically the, the start of a new rally to the upside. And this and, and cryptos could and Bitcoin could rip today. You can see a move through twenty four k. Basically testing that high from uh, from back at the end of July around twenty four seven hundred. Um, Ripple, Bitcoin, Litecoin now just been trading below sixty sixty being the key psychological level. Ethereum tried breaking out. It's been a bit of a false one to be honest. You did see that break on the H four and for all intents and purposes, you got that close above the previous highs and. You know, maybe from there it was an expectancy that we could move up into 2000, but then it just false breaks back down into 17, but holding quite nicely at 17. Similar scenario now, you've had a continuation, a series of high lows in this move uh, for Ethereum as well, since that double bottom that was saw off the 1000 handle. Um, if we get that hotter the number than expected, maybe see a 1550 print today. Can't even rule out 1400, but maybe not. I think there's good support here at 1550. If we get a weaker number than expected, then we could see this market basically rip through the 1780, 1790 area and then move into 2000 is on the cards this week. That's a wrap for the crypto brief for today. See you all inside the chat room where we'll be live discussing the US CPI releases shortly and how the models are set up to take some trades. Till next time, all the best of your trading and bye for now.